Let's get started. Create a new composition. Go to composition, click new. Rename it main. For this I'm using full HD. Frame per second is 25 and duration of this composition is 20 second. Click OK. Now create a new solid. Right click, new and click solid. Rename it to sound keys. Click OK. Now add the music file to this project. Add the music to the timeline. Perfect. Let's play it. Now go to effects and presets and go to trap code and select sound keys. Add the effect to the sound keys layer. Perfect. Add the audio layer. Change none to the music file. Good. Now match the highest beat in the screen. Now create a new solid layer. Right click, new and click solid layer. Rename it to Sphere. Now go to Effects and Presets and go to Trap Code and add a Tau effect to Sphere layer. Perfect. Go to Path Generator, change size to 40. Now go to Segment. Change segments to 400 and size to 100. Change size Y to 190. Go to Repeat Paths and then to First Repeater. Change R1 Repeatations to 2. Change R1 World Pose X from 100 to 0. And R1 World Rotate X to 40. Good. Now go to Fractal Displacement. Change Fractal Type to Multi. Now move the timeline to 0 seconds. Click Stopwatch next to Evolution and change the value to 0. Now move the timeline to 20 seconds. And now change the value to 5000. Now go to Material and Lighting, change Diffuse from 70 to 100. Diffuse Softness from 100 to 125. Go down, go to Image Based Lighting. Change the built-in environment to Dark Industrial. Change Reflection Strength from 100 to 85. Go to Shaders. Change Shader from Flat to Smooth. Perfect. Now lastly go to World Transform. Move Timeline to 0. Click Stopwatch next to W Rotate X, Y and Z. Now move the timeline to 20 seconds and change the value of all by 1000. Change W Position on Z Axis to minus 200. Perfect. Now right click on the timeline and add a spotlight to this composition. Rename it to Light. Choose the color as per your need. Intensity is 350 degree and cone angle is 115 degree. Click OK. Now press P to open the position and change the X axis to 960, Y axis to 540 and Z axis to minus 1500. As you can see there is some roughness to the sphere. You can go to sphere layer and to the effects panel and change segments and sides. Uncheck the break sides and chamfer. Now go back to sound keys layer and to effects panel. Go to range 1. Change fall off to exponential. Output to custom. Change the maximum value to 200. Go down and click the apply button. Now go to timeline and press U on the sound keys layer to open the output effect. Go to sphere layer and to fractal displacement. 
Hold Alt button and press the stopwatch next to Amplitude to create a script. Now take the Pickwick tool and match it with output of sound keys layer. Now check your animation. Go to sound keys layer and change the maximum value to 150. Perfect. Now select all the layer and pre-compose it. And rename it to sphere. Now add a background layer to this composition. Now open the sphere layer and copy the music file and the sound keys layer and paste it to the main composition. Change the background layer color from white to dark gray. And make it into 3D. Now right click on the timeline and add a point light to this layer. Change the color of light to white. Click OK. Go to sound keys layer. Select the audio layer again and click the stopwatch next to output. Change the minimum value to 100 and maximum to 300. Click apply to it. Perfect. Press the U key. Go to light and open its intensity property. Hold Alt button and click the stopwatch next to intensity and select the Pickwick tool to match it with output. That is folks for today. I hope you like my video. If you like the video, please click the like button. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe to it. Thank you and have a nice day.